On Friday, Catherine Zeta-Jones came to the defense of her husband of 17 years, Michael Douglas, after he was accused of sexual misconduct by a former employee 30 years ago. It was the same day Susan Brody appeared on Today to claim the 73-year-old movie star masturbated in front of her during her three years working at his company Stonebridge Productions. The two-time Oscar winner had preemptively denied Brody's Me Too movement offering in a January 9 Deadline article calling it a complete lie, fabrication, no truth to it whatsoever. Scroll down for video Michael had to come out preemptively because of what he believes in, the 48-year-old Oscar winner explained on Friday's The View. He was articulate, said it from the heart. He was honest, open, and transparent he now has to take the next step for where he goes from here. It's a question for him it happened 30 years ago, it was BC. Before Catherine. The Traffic co-stars, who have a 25-year age difference, first met in 1996 at the Deauville Film Festival, and they've remained together despite a six-month split in 2013. Regarding sexual harassment, Catherine worries for her 14-year-old daughter Carries, but she didn't express the same sentiment about her 17-year-old son Dylan with Douglas. I have a daughter as we battle through now, I hope that this is something she won't even have to think about when she gets into the workplace, Zeta Jones explained. Look, I support this movement, time's up and me too, 110%. Always have since the moment it really opened up to the public because we all know it's been going on for years and not just in our industry. It's been happening across the board everywhere. As for her own experiences with powerful men in Hollywood, the glamorous Welsh woman admitted, I hold my heart and thank the Lord, no, no I was never victimized or attacked. The feud actress will next play real-life Colombian drug lord Griselda Blanco in Guillermo Navarro's made-for-TV movie Cocaine Godmother premiering this Saturday on Lifetime.